Hello everybody, welcome back. If you saw my last episode, you would have seen that I was building a decent size item sorter. I mean, I've seen people that have every single item in the game sorted, which is just, I think, absolutely nuts. I mean, uh, I had one hell of an issue with this thing. I don't want to tell you, but I'll tell you anyways. Um, as you guys can obviously tell, if you've seen the last video, I had minecarts that were running around. Well, that was all good, but they kept despawning whenever I would go out of here. I don't know if that was due to um, clear lag plug-in or what. So, and also they weren't that efficient. They weren't picking things up as the... Uh, dropper was dropping them on the tracks it just wasn't working at all so that just fueled my anger a little bit I got a little pissed off you know I mean and then uh, I checked every all all these chests and here items weren't like making it past the first two and the reason why because everything was going in there and I double checked and triple checked everything with oh you need to have 22 items in the first one and then I was watching a video where you have to have 64 of the item in the bottom one and sticks well that's not the way it was supposed to be put it that way and if you can tell doing every single one of these chests like that with the item you know I mean keep going into keep going in here keep keep clicking you know you go one two you know I get the saplings all that all that good shit well, it turned out that it, I was, the design I saw was wrong. I had these hoppers shooting right down into these hoppers. They're not supposed to do that. There's, I don't know what the difference is, but it made a hell of a world difference. These are supposed to come back and aim towards the comparator. Now, what, what does that do? I'm not a comparator expert. I'm not a hopper expert, but I know one thing is it sure as hell works now. Um... I'm going to clean everything up. I've already gotten a few chests cleared out. Get rid of that one. I got two more chests plus some of the items uh, that didn't make it through. I'm going back and picking them up. I'm just really doing every item I have right now. Um, no, I also have, I have two miscellaneous chests. Because you're always going to, I mean, I'm not going to build one. I've seen them people, um... Who was it? Um, I can't think of his name right now, but it wasn't Etho. Oh shit, now it's gonna bug the hell out of me. I can't remember his name, but he had a two massive freaking rooms with all these with uh, with chests just lined up. Every item in the game, seriously, every item in the game, and I'm like, you gotta be shitting me. That's, I mean, that's a lot of work. You I mean with World Edit, I could always just copy and paste this and tag it along, you know, break out this wall, put it down there, and everything. But then that just I have to go back through and then change over all the items and everything. I mean, it's a lot of work. You know, I might do it in the future. I'm not going to do it right now. I don't have the willpower to really. <laughs> but this is working great. Uh, this is a trap chest, so I believe you got to Wait, yeah, 45, 48, you know, so, I mean, it's working, and here's my two miscellaneous chests, I, I put two, just in case, I don't want things to back up at all, um, these are the items, didn't do, um, I might do ores, um, do all them, might tag them on, but, uh, how I have it is whenever things come in through my little double chest through the wall there, all they do is you just come up through here, and, oh shit, can't fly. And they just get spit out. I just put this glass wall just to make sure nothing falls on the ground. And they just get spit out onto the hoppers, and then they just travel over top of uh, the sorting hoppers, and then down to the chest hopper, and then into the chest. Very simple, whenever you finally figure the damn thing out. But I'll tell for anybody that actually wants to build one of these, it's not hard. I mean, survival mode, eh, you can build a small one, you know, 
three or four wide just for stupid things you know I mean obviously you don't need I have two double chest you know like, like I said I don't want anything to back up um, I don't know if this is backup proof I'm not I don't think it really would be because if it would if these would back up that means all the items would get stuck into I think that hopper right there like if I had cobblestone it all get stuck right there it means nothing will get into m the miscellaneous just, but that's nothing that's we'll just say it's food I have food down here it's chicken you know chicken gets stuck here it fills up that means everything from here down can't get back can't well can't get down so that means this whole line will get back up I do have a lot a a lot of hoppers here I didn't need this many but also gave me a little bit of security uh, if there is a backup then there is a lot of storage here you know I mean each each hopper carries five stacks you know you figure out how many hoppers I have plus these uh, droppers carry nine so but I mean it's working for the most part I'm very happy I finally got it done I just got to go through and get these miscellaneous items out of here like all these here um, stuff like that and just throw them back in through the cycle hey, this is watermelon I do got a I, uh, I should actually make uh, probably another oh I don't know ten or so chests like this I, I, I probably will just copy and paste through world edit oh but uh, I have found a problem with world edit whenever you do that um, whenever I copied my mob spawner sometimes random redstone either compare I've had a comparator disappear I've had um, I've had even just one speck of redstone disappear before and I'm trying to sit there and figure out what the hell went wrong in the copy and, or in the cut and paste and here it's just one tiny tiny piece of redstone that just stops you now I might not say much for that but whenever you yeah, I'll show you guys here in a second let me get everything in here everything I can for right now anyways yeah I'll go back down into here But whenever you're missing a piece of redstone, it's like, you know, you, you're missing a repeater that's clear down there. That means, or, or even just in the middle. I mean, I guess you could always try to count them and come into here and break through. Uh, I mean, that's just such a pain in the ass. But, I mean, what are you going to do? I'd rather use World Edit again than freaking um, have to do all these over. This was nothing but a sob story for me here I'm gonna put some just to make sure mobs don't spawn right here I gotta break all these fucking torches yep I'm gonna break them all oh come on <sighs> it is what it is though and I'm happy I finally got it done uh, but for anybody for future reference that ever wants to build one of these things make sure you have that that uh it would be the second hopper if you do this kind of system or first hopper if you do a rail system make sure it's facing in towards the comparator that's my that was the issue I had well I do this all over again hell no fuck that I mean if I had to start from scratch again no I wouldn't um, I'm just happy that got it finally done just fixing the floor here a little bit yeah uh, that's gonna be a bit so I can always put them up like that I'm gonna be laying half slabs all over here wow, what the hell happened there uh, okay well, that's a pain in the ass. That's another thing, guys. Don't lay half slabs down in front of there. Apparently, half slabs will overpower. They'll, they'll let you set them down, but they also destroy the item frames. So that's great. So I'll have to go back and fix that. Oh, my God. See, this has just been a freaking nightmare for me. Uh, but I guess it is what it is. 
I'm not going to turn back now. Then my next video, I should have um, for my, I do want to make a rail cart, um, a mine cart with a chest, come down and park its ass somewhere. I'll probably just have it come down to here or something, just make hoppers come over to it. But I do want an automatic minecart system for uh, my mob farm I have. So any th so I don't have to always run there and get everything out of the chest and then run back here and throw it in the throw it in the chest to be sorted. I mean it would just make it simpler. A lot simpler. I don't need all these damn torches. I don't care. I just laid them down. Whenever I even have night vision on, so I really didn't even need them. I mean, but uh, you guys want to just take a screenshot of that. I mean, it's very easy to build. Very simple. I'm not going to give a tutorial just because there are a dime a dozen on YouTube. But for future reference, I mean, just always remember that this goes into that. I don't know why it might not even have to be that, but one thing it does work. So whenever something works, uh, I just go with it. I can just do this, just to get rid of these here. I'm gonna need them all. Probably I'm gonna need them all again anyways. But well, guys, um, yeah, um, don't know actually. I'd have to dig up. Hopefully, I don't hit water. I know that there was, there's an ocean pretty much like over here on the other side of this bedrock. There is an ocean right there. There's even some water. I blocked it right there. I don't know where it all extends to. I don't know how far over I can go, but if that thing would come in and flood this, I mean, I wouldn't go too far, but if, you know, I was so terrified of breaking these blocks up above me here and they, and they come down and ruin all this redstone. I would have been, well, I would have just stopped it right there. I, I would have just deleted everything. But it didn't happen. I don't know what's going on with my mouse there. But, uh, guys, thank you for watching. Uh, this is just an update. And uh, I greatly appreciate everybody that watches my videos. Like and subscribe. Everybody have a good night. Thank you.